Well, I'm the wife of a man who had Alzheimer's. He suffered for, I would say, 12 years of before he passed. That was the worst 12 years of my life and his life. My father was diagnosed with Alzheimer's when he was approximately 68 years old. And um, when he was first diagnosed, I really, although I was upset and I knew I could see him changing, I really had no concept as to how deep and how sad the disease really is. It's a disease that's progressive. I mean, scary. Changes your personality ruined your home life. When my father was initially diagnosed, they used the term hardening of the arteries because he was already in his 60s and uh, apparently at the time uh, they couldn't give a conclusive diagnosis that it was Alzheimer's until actually a person passes and in the autopsy they would be able to see plaque in the brain. So with the initial hardening of the arteries, we certainly had hope in the beginning that it was just going to be, um, you know, an occasional senior moment and forgetfulness. Unfortunately, um, as the disease progressed, you could clearly see that it was much more than hardening of the arteries. I took him to doctors. I thought maybe he had a stroke. No, it wasn't that. The loss of memory is uh, one very, very small part of the disease. Um, it's very difficult for the caregiver. My mother took care of my father. He never had to go to a nursing home. But he catnapped for probably five years where my mother never really had a good night's sleep. My nights were horrible. As soon as he would see I was sleeping, he would wake me up, get out of bed, walk around the apartment. It's a sad, sad life. And there's nothing you could do about it. I remember talking to somebody in the elementary schoolyard and I told him that my father had Alzheimer's and the woman said, oh, does he know who you are? And I was like, of course he knows who I am. He's my father. Um, never thinking that one day it would actually be that um, he didn't, he knew that we had a, a bond, but he didn't really remember that I was his daughter. He told me I was a very good friend of his. But I could see in the pictures, you could see even in his eyes, his walk. I mean, It's a, it's a horror. Alzheimer's is a deadly disease that doesn't have uh, the recognition of other terminal illnesses like cancer or heart disease. As someone who's seen the disease firsthand, I always you know, wonder if I have the gene where that's what's going to happen to me. I saw my father fade away from the disease. I've seen friends of mine, their parents fade away from Alzheimer's and it's the identical disease in every case. Um, it's a very, very sad, painful, ugly way to end your life. And I certainly hope that by the time, um, you know, within the next 10 years that they could get a handle on diagnosing it early and hopefully finding a cure or a, a way to slowed the progression of the disease. I mean, you have to have a happy marriage if you're going to get sick. That will save your life. 